comics of 100 years ago, February 8th, 1920, it's Crazy Cat by Harriman. You may be interested in knowing that it is Ignatz Mouse's daily custom to crease Crazy Cat's knob with a brick. Then again, you may not give a darn about it. How should we know? However, oh my goodness, hour after hour, I have waited here for Ignatz to send me a missile of love. And so far, he has not yet tossed a brick at me, not even a pebble. Oh, why, oh, why is me? Another hour passes. He comes not. And yet one more hour is peeled off the roll of eternity. He comes not. Tempest turns over another leaf. He comes not. Having wearied of pictorial arising, a cat's anguish, and time, it's in our immutable flight. We will now dally a moment with the mean side of our tale. Ignatz lies ill of a cider hangover, impounded in bed, impotent, supine, and autois. While physically inactive, we beg that you notice the indomitable fervor and verve of his mad of his mind, however. Dog gun it! This day is lost to me, for infirmity forbids that I know my daily joy of bending a brick over that crazy cat's canoodle. His bedside, to his bedside comes that canny Hidalgo, Don Coyote, who, for weal or woe, offers his services for the mere dole of a nickel or a or small dime. Ah, Signor Aton, I am at your service. Do a good job of it, and I'll pay you well, Don. Time takes another switch in the fabric of mortality. He comes not. Zig, dog bite my hide. Little way, I'll wager it was no mouse's hand that wielded that brick. A attempt to deceive me has been perpetrated. Oh, so that's who done it, huh? Dag nab ye, ye ain't no, there ain't no coyote that can take a liberty like that at me and not feel my anger, you wild willin, zig bap. Don't I get something extra under the compensation law, Signor Ignacio? Not a kopeck extra. He comes not. Time takes toll of yet another hour, bringing to the hand bringing to hand the moment at which our duty to is to you, our duty to tell you that love by proxy never has done another any good particularly the proxy the end